Hello ladies and gentlemen. Today we will explain how to import products into the Hikashop 2.1.2 uh, edition using our handy Excel spreadsheet that we have here. Now note that there are actually two spreadsheets within this workbook. Uh, this help tab here will just give you information on how to locate this visual uh, this visual uh, tutorial as well as if you need paid assistance uh, such as data entry or just Joomla in general you can always visit us online at tony.com that's t-o-n-e-e-e dot -E -E com that's three e's now to get started let's go ahead and click the first spreadsheet here you'll see that we have about four demo products listed and you'll notice that the column headers are green as well as light gray the ones in green and green excuse me are the ones that are recommended whereas the ones in light gray are optional now you would go ahead and input your product name uh, the cost the name of the image which if you take a look here we'll go ahead and show you the formula bar you see the name of the image here as well as the product description which is very important and maybe you want to go ahead and add a category so in this case we'll go ahead and put this in that general category now you can also add multiple categories to a product by just separating them by commas and if the product category doesn't exist it will automatically create it for you so that's pretty nice uh, or you can use the category ID number if you know it which is in Joomla you know if you go ahead and for example go into a shop which is the components here and categories you'll see the category ID number and you can enter that into the spreadsheet now next we will also uh, I'll actually I will let you know that I've tried to insert as many uh, instructions and tips as possible if you look at the little red tabs they will give you little tips on uh, the most important columns or columns that may be confusing now another feature of the success spreadsheet is that it has frozen panes meaning that as you scroll over to the right the uh, product name column still remains on the left there so that will help you and same with the number of, you know if you scroll down and there are several products even hundreds the product uh, the uh, column headers would stay on top next we'll talk about print preview which will allow you to print this document with the column headers in place so you can see this green bar or the column header is still here and as you scroll down it'll also go ahead and show you the gray bar but it'll keep the product name on the left just like it did while you were editing and if you needed to update the page number you could go to page setup and in the footer or header you could choose one of these options and you'll see it will change and that's pretty cool for printing of course you would just hit print in order to print so we're going to go ahead and close print preview and I'm going to now show you how to export this into Hikashop we're going to export as a CSV file which is a comma delimited file just go back over to this menu and go to save as and other formats and instead of an Excel workbook we are going to choose CSV comma delimited and we're just going to call this my product import of course you can name it anything you want now it's going to explain that you know you can't save formats or multiple sheets you just hit OK and it is going to say that it's not compatible to certain things with the woo just say yes and it will go ahead and save it as a CSV file next we will go into Hikashop and we're going to go under products and import and this is in Joomla of course 
Excel does a great job exporting to CSV, especially the workbook that we provided. So we're going to go ahead and choose a CSV file, obviously the one we just created. And we're just going to click import. Now you can set these other options, but they're usually set properly. But you can go ahead and review them. And when you're ready, just click import. And it will go ahead and upload the file based on what we provided. And you'll see it says four products found and four products imported. Just to take a look, you can go back to the Hikishop dashboard. Click products. And you will see them there. You'll see the different product categories. And in this case, we created... I believe it was general and four men. And you can see the product is there. It created its own product code. There's the price and everything. And that concludes today's tutorial. If you have any questions, uh, just go ahead and visit us online at Tony.com or reply to whatever forum you found this in and we'll try to get back to you. If you need paid assistance you can also contact us and good luck with your import.